Google Bard as an interesting update. This is a video extension or YouTube extension. Okay. And this is about getting insights from videos. So if you click on video insights over here in Google Bard, it gives this prompt which says, give me insights about this video. Organize the information in a set of easy to scan bullet points. So here I have a video of mine. I'll copy the link. I'll just paste it over here. And let's try out this particular link now. So this is a video about chatting with your data using Llama 2, Llama index. Basically it is about retrieval augmented generated chatbots. So here it says that here are key insights from the video. How to chat with your data using Llama 2, Llama index and collab, indexing a PDF document and then chatting with it using a custom embedding model and LLM and things like that, right? So it explains that indexing a PDF document using sentence transformers, creating a query engine, sending a query to the LLM and things like this, right? So I can actually ask, you know, uh, at what time, what time in the video does code start? training lab notebook right in the video let's see what it gives it's actually processing now and okay it uses this youtube extension because youtube is again owned by google so it is very uh, seamless okay it says the code starts at 000 because i just start off with the notebook over here the video okay Maybe I need to change the question and I kind of, I can ask like, okay, uh, at what, what time? In being asked. See what is out. Uh, while it's processing i've also seen that you know if your videos doesn't have say uh, captions or it if they deem it as potentially unsafe content if the content isn't a valid youtube link then this may not work okay that's what they're saying over here when i tried it out with the link of one of my videos where i don't have captions this was the output which i got so let's see, uh, the question is asked at zero. So there are erroneous outputs also possible uh, because when I tried it earlier and I said like, give me more insights about this video, uh, it actually gave a nice uh, summary or what are the concepts explained in the video. It gave me a nice summary. Here yeah, I can copy this and out. So this feature can actually revolutionize education. It can make your uh, video more engaging. So currently it says that I'm sorry, but I'm, I'm unable to access this YouTube content. Okay. Uh, this is after two, three steps. So probably I can change this prompt as, you know, I can give me insights about this video. Sort of, okay. In what call? Is explain copy this particular um, intro to large language models from Andrej Karpati. This is a very interesting video, very uh, insightful video. So let's see what happens here. I'm just changing the prompt and I'm seeing uses this YouTube extension. Okay. So this is a great feature. It makes uh, long videos more easily. Uh, you can get insights from long videos. You can go into particular timestamps in a video, right? So here it says the speaker and Rich Karpati starts by explaining what LLMs are. He says they are just two files. So it gives the concept. Okay, it explains 
um, the concept, uh, a kind of summarization of this particular YouTube video. So this is an interesting feature which has come up in BARD. This could revolutionize education. It could make YouTube videos more interactive. But at the same time, this might hurt YouTube content creators um, because um, their monetization and other things could be affected over here. And over here with people just copying the link and asking for a summary and then navigating to a specific part of the video may reduce retention time of the video. Right, and this would uh, affect the uh, recommendations of this video to other uh, YouTube viewers because the YouTube uh, algorithm looks at uh, video retention as well. So I don't know how this is going to pan out in the long term in terms of uh, you know, for the content creators, how this feature would affect their content in terms of monetization, in terms of viewing times and other things. But this is an interesting new feature of BARD. You can also go and Try it out. So this was a short video on this YouTube extension present within BARD with the latest update. I hope this video is useful to you. If you like the video, please like, share, subscribe to the channel. See you in another video.